Hey everybody, Mike here and welcome back to the channel. So today we're going to be doing a video on crease sets. Now, um, crease sets is something that I really never hear anybody talk about. And I love doing videos, uh, you know, on tools that are a little bit obscure, I would say. Um, and I think there's something very cool about it. Let's say you are blocking out a model. You don't really know yet exactly what you're going to make. It's kind of a design phase, concept phase, right? And you don't want to add a whole bunch of geometry. The thing is, if you preview smooth something and you haven't you know, added edges to the edge, then it's going to collapse and that's not what you want, right? So you're going to have to put in a whole bunch of edges, but at the same time, you don't know what you want to do just yet. You have to go back, delete them and so forth. Well, that's where presets comes in, okay? So let's say I'm going to take a sphere right here, right? And I'm going to play around with this shape. I don't know exactly what I'm going to do just yet, but let's go in here and, um, I don't know, take some vertices, uh, hit B for smooth, hit W to move it around. I don't know, something like this maybe, whatever, right? Okay, now, if I go in here and I hit 3 for preview smooth, you'll get something like this. But what if I have a more distinct shape in mind and I want to reinforce that? Now, I could go in here and let's say take this edge, let me turn off soft select, that edge, and for example, this edge, and I could bevel it, right? Now, if I do that, let's hit bevel, let's hit a fraction of 0 0.01, I now have added geometry, right? If I go in here and I hit 3 for PV smooth, you'll see those lines going on which is nice, but again, I added um, the subdivision level. Hit one to go back. So let's say I change my mind. I have to go back in and delete those. Now, I don't want that. So I'm going to hit Control Z or Z to go back here. And the bevel is now gone. And instead, what I'm going to do is go in here, double click on this guy, double click on this guy, and I'm going to go up to uh, Windows. We're going to go to Modeling Editors uh, right there. Presets, and we're going to click on new. We want a new preset. Boom. Okay. So now if we go in here in object mode and hit three, we have the exact same effect, which is nice, right? But the very cool thing about it is, and this is of course a super simple object, but let's say you have this going on all over the place, is I can simply click on it and click on delete. It will delete the preset, and there you go. Pretty cool, right? So yeah, I suggest you guys have some fun with that. Uh, let me know if you enjoy it. Let me know if you got any questions. And um, yeah, that's it for this video. More videos to come in the near future about cool tools. Okay, let me know in the comments what you think. Bye.